Hi everyone, welcome to our new lesson. In this lesson, you're going to learn a new letter, the letter VAL. This is the letter VAL. The sound of this letter is IV. It has the same sound, the TH in the article V. V. Now, let's write together the letter VAL. It's so simple. It's the identical twin of DAL, but with a dot above. Now, like DAL, VAL connects only from the right. It only can connect to the letter that comes before it. It never connects to the letter that comes after it. VAL with al fatha is THE. THE. As an example, the word VAHAB. VAHAB, which means gold. Say after me. VAHAB. 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 VAL with al dhamma is THU. ذو ذو as an example the word ذرة ذرة which means corn say after me ذو ذرة ذرة now do you remember التاء المربوطة التاء المربوطة it's a shape of a ta. It comes only at the end of the word. If a ta marbuta doesn't have a short vowel, and I say here the types of short vowels I'm talking about here are al fatha, al dhamma, al kasra. It's not pronounced in this case. We just pronounce the letter that comes before it. So here we say dhura. Okay, VAL with al kasra is THE, THE. As an example, the word ذئب, ذئب. VAL with al kasra is THE, al hamza with al sukun is I. and al ba at the end of the word IB, ذئب. ذئب ذئب ذال وذا السكون is إذ إذ as an example the word جذع جذع which means a trunk جذع إذ جذع 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 Now we'll do a quick revision as usual. This is the letter VAL. The sound of the letter VAL is IV. 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 VAL. IV. THE. Is VAL when it's pronounced with al fatha. THE. ذهب. ذهب. Which means gold. ذهب. ذال with a dhamma is pronounced ذو. ذو. As an example, the word ذرة. ذرة. Which means corn. ذرة. ذرة. 
ذال وذا الكسرة is ذئب ذال وذا الكسرة is ذي pardon me it's found in the word ذئب which means a wolf ذئب ذئب ذال وذا السكون is pronounced إذ As an example, the word جذع, which means a trunk. جذع, جذع. إذ جذع. Now to the letter the ذال, when it comes accompanied with one, sorry, with a e, the long vowels in Arabic. إذ أنت ذا. As an example, the word هذا. هذا in Arabic means this is. In fact, in Arabic, we don't need a verb to be. One word is enough to say this is, which is the word هذا. هذا. Now let's learn a full sentence in the Arabic language. هذا. ذئب. This is a wolf. هذا ذئب. هذا ذئب. هذا ذئب. Now, إذ أنت أو ذو. As an example, the word بذور. بذور. Which means seeds. Budur. Say after me. Budur. Event E, V. As an example, the adjective Leviv, which means delicious. Leviv. Leviv. Now, can you see this is delicious in Arabic? I think you can. هذا لذيذ. This is delicious. Now, to a quick revision. إذ أنت أ ذا. إذ أنت أو ذو. إذ أنت إي ذي. ذا ذو ذي. إذ أنت أ ذا exists in the word هذا, which means this is. هذا this is هذا this is إذ أنت أو ذو is found in the word بذور بذور which means seeds بذور بذور and finally, event E is the, as in the adjective, لذيذ, which means delicious. لذيذ. لا. ذيذ. لذيذ. That's it for today, my friends. Hope this lesson was useful. Have a good time.